Hi guys, this is Don, and I'm going to take a couple of minutes here to show you how to find and download Tree Plan, which has Decision Tree as part of that, and then to open Excel and to activate that add in within Excel. So the first thing we want to do is to navigate to treeplan.com treeplan.com t-r-e-e-p-l-a-n.com and you should see this screen and there's our old familiar decision tree I blow that up a little bit that we'll be making using um, tree plan decision tree it's really pretty straightforward so let's go back to this page and we don't want to buy tree plan unless you want to later on click on trial and then download tree plan trial and if you're in Windows 10 or something close to that you should see it show up down here in the lower corner of your screen okay so that's how you download it now I'll show you how to install it next start Excel and have just an empty worksheet workbook and th this is Excel excuse me yes Excel 2016 so your process should be similar to that unless you've got a very old version of Excel or if you're on the Mac but click on file options brings up this dialog box we want to click on Trust Center, Trust Center Settings, on the Add-ins tab of the Trust Center. We want to make sure that these are unchecked. Then we click on Macro Settings, and we want to make sure everything is unchecked except the Disable All Macros with Notification. Select that. Click OK, and then OK. Okay, now we want to navigate to where the downloaded tree plan files are stored. And in my case, when I download, it goes into downloads. Uh, you may not see tree plan at the top of your list. Um, if you don't, click on date modified, sometimes twice, and then make sure that your cursor has brought you to the very top and you should see tree plan 202 trial files now this is a zip file so that means we've got to unzip it on my computer with Windows 10 I left click it to select it whoops and then right click to bring up the menu to extract here okay and I'm going to click on name put everything in alphabetical order I put my backwards and here are my tree plan 202 files you can see I had an older version of tree plan that I had to uninstall from from my system okay so there are our tree plan files both the Mac version and the Windows version when you have Excel open if you click on add-ins you'll get a drop-down and if you don't have tree plan and in install you won't see these three things tree plan student license for education only decision tree you'll just have a blank there okay I'm back in my Excel application and what we want to do is to go to that tree plan XLA file and open it don't be tempted to use your Windows Explorer and just double click on the XLA that probably will not work properly so let's go to file open and I'm going to browse I'm going to go to my downloads that's where mine stored and then I'm going to and drag down until I see tree plan and you'll see three files there there's an example for Macs 
the example for Windows, and we'll open that in a second, and then the tree plan add in 1605. So click on that to select it and click open. Okay, and you'll get this message that says there's macros here. The default is disable macros. We want to select enable macros to make sure it will work. You can then go to add ends and you can see there it added in an additional uh, the updated version the tree plan trial I had the old version there and let me click on that and see if it starts and it asked me for a new tree and it gives me this little bitty tree to start with now from that you can build a very large tree Let's go back and go to File, Open, Browse, and then again near where your add-in is, I'm going to click on the example and open that. There we go. A, another workbook, book, and this has a number of examples in it. Got to enable editing, of course. Um, shows you an original tree. If you click over here in the middle, there's a tab. That has, oh, I, for some reason went to the bottom there, uh, the basic procedure for how to use tree plan. You can just read that and then go. And again, there's a number of, of samples here that you can look at and experiment with to um, learn a little more about tree plan. And that's really all there is to it.